Uh, the House agree for us to agree and pass the second reading of this very important bill. This so deliberation by lawmakers in the Kano State House of Assembly this, uh, flags of the reforms of the state's the traditional institutions. The dynasty is not a new creation. It's a recreation of Gaya, Ranu, and uh, Arai. The third, the fourth one is Buchi, which is the new creation. Uh, can I say MS appointment and the position amendment law 2019-1440A has secured and said a lot today to be considered in the committee of the other house. The other house agree for me step down the item number one from the notice of motion to the order of the day. The passing of the Amir's so appointments and deposition the bill the was closely followed by the governor's assent to the bill and then appointment of new first-class Amir's. There is no doubt history has been made. The history whereby the traditional institution in Kano State has been given more impetus in order to work closely with the subjects and with the government to ensure that all the services that the government provides to the people, such services are being provided optimally. In Bichi Emirates, Governor Abdullahi Ganduje is received by the new Emir, Al Haja Amina Adu Bayeru after which the governor presented him with a staff of office. Then the governor moves to Karai, one of the Emirates that has been independent from the Kano Emirate long before the Jihad of Usman Danford you. At the presentation ceremony, Governor Ganduji further revealed his intention to create more traditional institutions in Kano. The main purpose of establishing additional emirates in Kano State is for peace and stability, is for development, is to enhance security and to increase the participation of traditional institution in governance in Kano State. The governor is confident that the new emirates will have direct impact on the lives of the people. I wish to assure His Excellency and the entire people of Kano State that we will work with the Emma of Kano as a chairman of the Kano State Emirate Council to promote the development of the state and ensure peaceful existence of our people. It's certainly a week-long event for both the legislators, the executive, judiciary, and even the traditional institutions in Kano State. From the signing of the AMS Appointment and Deposition Act into law by the governor, to the official recognition of the four additional AMS, to the presentation of staff of office to the newly appointed first class AMS. From Kano, Idris Jibrin, reporting for Channels Television News.